Good evening, everybody. This is Steve Fletcher with The Trumpet for My People. Today is October 8th, 2024, and I want to talk to you about Hurricane Milton. But there's a very interesting and very important detail with Hurricane Milton is that Milton is connected to Hurricane Michael. I want to show you uh, what this means. Uh, the list of storms named Michael. The name Michael was used for three tropical cyclones in the Atlantic Ocean. Hurricane Michael, a Category 2 hurricane that affected Canada. Hurricane Michael of 2012, a Category 3 hurricane that did not affect land. And, Cat and Hurricane Michael 2018, a Category 5 hurricane that formed near Central America, causing heavy flooding as it lingered over the area as a tropical depression. Later, rapidly intensified over the Gulf of Mexico, making landfall in Florida at peak intensity, Michael caused at least 74 fatalities and an estimated 25.1 billion in damages. The World Meteorological Organization retired the name Michael from use after the 2018 season. Michael has been replaced with Milton for the 2024 season. In other words, the worst hurricane to ever hit uh, Florida, Category 5, 2018, was named Michael. And now we have Hurricane Milton, which is also one of the worst hurricanes that rapidly intensified in the Gulf of Mexico, looking to hit uh, Florida. Michael has been changed to Milton. So in 2018, it was Hurricane Michael. And if they had not changed the name, it would be Hurricane Michael again. And it's the same description, rapidly intensifying in the Gulf of Mexico, heading directly for Florida as a Cat 5 hurricane. Michael, making the biblical connection to Michael, the archangel. Michael is mentioned by name five times in the Bible. In Daniel 10, it talks about the battle of Michael. Gabriel said, Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me. Daniel 10, 21, no one supports me against all these except Michael, your prince. Daniel 12, at that time there shall be, there shall arise Michael, the great prince, guardian of your people. Jude 9, Michael is identified as an archangel. And in Revelation uh, 12, Michael is mentioned in the battle against the dragon, the war in heaven, Revelation chapter 12. Michael is also mentioned in the Old Testament twice, in the New Testament twice. The word archangel is only used twice in the Bible and both times in reference to Michael. 1 Thessalonians 4.16, the Bible describes the voice of an archangel that will announce Jesus Christ's return. And in Jude 9, Michael is identified as the archangel. So the Bible describes the voice of an archangel that will announce Jesus Christ's return. There's only one archangel mentioned by name in the Bible, and that is Michael. Michael is an archangel and is often depicted as the leader of the heavenly hosts and the warrior who helps the children of Israel. His name means who is like God and who is equal to God. So Hurricane Milton, which could also be considered Hurricane Michael, because Michael was retired and given the name Milton. So if they had not retired the name Michael, this would indeed be Hurricane Michael. This rapidly intensified above the north. Uh, Milton, near peak intensity northwest of the Yucatan Peninsula on October 7th, and it was formed on October 5th. Okay, formed on October 5th means that it was formed on the Feast of Trumpets. The new moon was spotted in Israel on October 4th. So between October 4th and October 5th in Israel was, was the Feast of Trumpets. Okay, so the voice of an archangel, the trumpet of God, announcing the coming of Jesus Christ 
on the Feast of Trumpets, starting on the Feast of Trumpets, and a war in heaven, if, if it goes 21 days, takes us to the timing of the Feast of Tabernacles. I'm watching anywhere from the beginning of the Feast of Tabernac Tabernacles, the full moon of October, October 17th and 18th. We may be looking at the whole week of Tabernacles that we have to watch even to the, the great eighth day of Tabernacles. So high watch for rapture anywhere from October 17th, October 18th, maybe even all, all the way to the end of Tabernacles, October 24th and 25th. And I think this is the message of Hurricane Milton or Hurricane Michael, Michael, the archangel of God. I pray you are blessed. This is Steve Fletcher with a trumpet for my people, the sign of his coming revealed.